Hey guys, Greg here on the Vinyl Rundown. Let's talk about the world's worst, weirdest, and rarest records. That's what we're doing today. Let me get this thing in focus. Let's start with uh, everybody's favorite game show host, Wink Martindale. And uh, two seconds, I'll have this thing all focused up. It'll be fabulous. There we go. Something like that. Wink Martindale, Deck of Cards. It's on the turntable now for you. Will be led, led by a child. What's going on here? Peace in the Valley. It's kind of a gospel -y sort of a thing. There'll be peace what in the uh, year? I have no idea. Me. There'll be Someday. peace in the valley. There'll be peace in the valley for me. Oh Lord, I pray. Okay. That's enough no wink Martindale for one day, I think, I think guys. Uh, we're just going to run through a bunch of oddball records, but uh, Dot Records, that one has a nice sleeve. What do we got in here? Pat Boone, Word Jazz by Ken Nordine. Lots of Pat Boone. Nice sleeve, though. All right. We got more goodies today, guys. Don't worry. Plenty more goodies. Where that came from. Have you guys heard this one? International Morris Code. Smith, the fine people at Smith brought us. Do you guys know how to do Morris Code? Check out the uh, awesome uh, label there. Chord Course, Herman Smith, Brooklyn, New York. Copyright 1957. We're going to skip to lesson six or seven because you guys are advanced. Yeah. This is a complete course on one record, Morse code. If you guys plan on joining, uh, you know, I don't know, the Coast Guard maybe? Check this out. It's got, it's got the whole alphabet. Like, M is da-da. And U is di da, -da. Special signals. Invitation to transmit. Everything you need here, guys, a complete language on one record. International Morris Code, 10 lessons, 15 words a minute, the modern practical method, Brooklyn, New York. <clears throat> you guys hang out in thrift shops like I do, you're bound to collect a lot of weirdo records, so I'm calling this the worst, weirdest, and rarest records of all time. You guys remember this guy? David McCallum, star of, uh, what's that show? Man From U.N.C.L.E.? A bit more of me. This one could actually get a copyright hit because it's on a real record label, Capitol Records, so. You can't go too long on this one. David McCallum, uh, let's see, conducts his impressions of Michelle, The Shadow of Your Smile, Batman theme. What does this say? Promo. Look the way I did promo back then. Poked braille holes in the record. Uh, this is him conducting. He's not even singing on here. Uptight by uh, Stevie Wonder. We're not going to go too long on this one. Capitol Records. We don't want them to come uh, busting our door down. But David McCallum. We paid... Oh my god, 99 cents. All right. Glad we didn't overpay. 99 cents worth of David McCallum. All right, guys. If you've heard this one, stop me because I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to bore you. But oh, this thing's filthy. It's scratched. You're gonna love it though. It's a barn burner. You're gonna love this one. It's a Columbia Six Eye. The compensating pause before the next beat. You guys want to study cardiology at home? It's the home cardiology study course. You can become a heart surgeon at home. Just send uh, 99 cents over to Columbia Records. And uh, George Geckler, MD, teaches you all about how the heartbeat's supposed to sound. A group of escultatory findings with suggestions to help in self-training. Back in the good old days, you could learn anything 
from an LP record. That's the beauty of LP records. You can learn to become, you can do open heart surgery at home. A three-dimensional model showing the frequency and intensity of musical yada yada, heart murmurs. Hey guys, we're recording in here, so keep it down. We're teaching people how to do heart surgery at home. It's a great cover though, isn't it? You got your ventricle, your aorta, your broken heart. <clears throat> and that's a Columbia 6 eye, believe it or not. That's a classic right up there with Miles Davis. The good people at Columbia. Masterworks. It's a Columbia Masterworks. Alright guys, how many was that? One, two, three, four. Uh, who else do we have here? You guys love this guy a bit. Soupy Sales. The Soupy Sales Show. Let's give a couple seconds to that. Reprise Records. That's Frank Sinatra's label. I guess Frank and Soupy were friends. These are probably, I don't know, music or talking? I don't know what's going on here. This record is scratched. How are you today? Soupy sales. Come on and say hello, Yippee. No, 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 no. Talk your head off. Oh, come on. Too scratched. Sorry, not good enough for our needle, guys. All right, guys, that's five of the world's weirdest, rarest records. Uh, part one. We'll come back with part two next time. Thanks for watching.